have a feeling it's endgame time, motherfuckers. Indeed. That being said, greetings, everyone. This is Potato Hedgehog, and welcome back to The Last of Us Part 2. Or should I say, welcome to the possible ending of The Last of Us Part 2? I'm not sure yet. Remind me to put a... Remind me to... Moshi, remind me to put whether or not this is the ending or not in, in editing. Got it. That being said, in the last episode, Abby beat the fuck out of Ellie, and we time-skipped to a farmhouse where Ellie's revenge was once again triggered by Tommy. So the rest of it... So the rest of this game is legitimately his fault. Can we just acknowledge that? Yeah, shame too, cause I was starting to like Tommy, until he triggered Ellie's revenge and PTSD. So, yeah, the rest of this game is indeed his fault. Yeah, so now we're just on the final few chapters of the game, I think, and we stepped back into the shoes of Ab Abigail Anderson. Abigail Arsonist Anderson. Abigail Asshole Arsonist Anderson. The third. Esquire. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, shut up. So Onward to adventure! Nah, to death, misery, and pain. So do we go back out the way we came, or... I think we go back out the way we came. Before we get intercepted. Yep, intercepted! It was too easy! I knew it! But hey, Abby abuse! Yes! Oh. What's this Hulk Hogan motherfucker doing here? What?! But it doesn't matter! Abby abuse! Yes! Beat this bitch to a pulp! No! Beat this bitch to a pulp! What are you doing? What are you doing? Come here, let me see. You ready? Wait, what are you doing? Wait, wait. Fuck, man! Thanks, Hulk Hogan. Well, Lev has conked the fuck out. Don't Poor guy. <laughs> yeah, if you could slit her throat, that would be fantastic. It would save Ellie the trouble. <laughs> well, the cut to black, so maybe Abby is dead? No, then the rest of this game wouldn't happen. Wishful thinking on your part, though, Moshi. Thanks. Wait, are we back with Ellie already? Yep, seems like it. And this is Owen's boat. Indeed. Yep. We're back with our favorite, very angry lesbian. You know, Ellie, you could have stopped. You could have fucking stopped a long time ago, and the rest of this game would not happen. But no, you had to pursue revenge. And now here we are, at the last few hours of this... experience. Yep. And from a certain angle, Ellie looks like Ellie Croft Tomb Raider. Except, um, you know, not British. Ah! Trapped! Yep, it was a trap! Ah! Why did you have to show Ellie getting impaled by a goddamn tree branch? And the switchblade's gone. Yep. Figures. 
Remember when you called Ellie, Ellie Croft Tomb Raider? Yeah, I can kind of see it now, considering she's taking just amount, just about as much punishment as, um, 2013 Laura Croft. Yeah, that sounds about right. Nope, Switchblade does not work on lock. Your lockpicking skill needs work. Oh, it was this door. Thanks for making it obvious. Oh, hi there. More context-sensitive button prompts, I think. Oh, yo! We got prison break, motherfuckers! Yes, indeed. Abby tried to escape. She's down in the pillars. The pillars? Head down to the beach. You won't miss it. She's probably already dead. We can go now. Come on. And we can go now. Our objective has been secured. Yeah, pretty much. To the beach! Or we can finally end this fucking game. It's not gonna be that easy, is it? Nope. Even though the... Even though the... Even though those prisoners are gonna take revenge on the, uh, Rattlers. Rightfully so, but still. Can we progress? Ah, Ellie's looking a little worse for wear right now. Seems like it. Ah, and the rattlers are the rattlers are going down. Girl, your side is fucked up. I would not be trying to pursue this any further. Yep, Ellie's side is fucked. Very, very fucked. They starting a riot over there. Yep. And we technically, we technically caused it, but what are you gonna do? Alrighty then, just heading down to the beach. They did mention that Abby is somewhere around here. Is that her? No, I think, I, mean, I think that isn't her. Nope, that's not her, that's just a desecrated cadaver. That's another desecrated cadaver. Potato, look right there. That's Abby, isn't it? Uh-huh. That's definitely her. And she is looking f ten times a fucked up. Not only that, she's looking less jacked. Hello, Abigail Anderson. You're looking pretty fucked. You know, you could easily kill her right now. Ellie, you could easily kill her right now. Why would you cut the bits down? So the ending of this game can happen. And then Abby goes to free Lev. Yep. Yeah, just sleep it off. You're, you'll be, you'll be fine, dude. Abby. I got you. I got you. There goes this way. Oh, 
all's well that ends well, right? Potato, did you forget what game this is? Ellie is not going to get a happy ending. Get up there, Ellie. Hey, wait up, Abby. My side is kind of killing me right now. Wait up, so I can plunge this switchblade into your fucking into your fucking jugular. Eh. I can't even sprint anymore. That's how bad this is. Got a boat, motherfuckers! Yes, for the last time. And the rapids are less. R the rapids are, res are are less ragey. You know, Ellie could take a boat right now. She could indeed take a boat right now. And that's the boat we've been seeing on the menu screen this entire time. Yep. So I've noticed. Yeah, that's that same boat. It's like the game was foreshadowing this the entire time. No! Don't you fucking dare! They're gonna do it, Potato. You knew this was coming. She's giving back into her revenge, so this... So this... So this can happen. I can't let you leave. What is the fucking point now? Even Abby says she doesn't want to fight. I mean, not that I don't mind the Abby abuse, but yeah, I don't mind the Abby abuse. No. I'm not gonna fight you. Oh, and here's the point where they make Ellie unlikable again. Symmetry, get it? Cause Ellie attacked Dina like um, attacked Dina earlier on. Oh, and by the way, final boss time. Yep, this this is what's happening right now. How fitting! Abby is the final enemy you must you must face for this game. Bring it on! Yeah! 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 Whoa! Okay, enough of that, Abigail Anderson! Fuck you! Fuck you for everything that you ever did! Fuck you for everything that you ever done in this fucking miserable experience! Fuck you for killing Joel! Fuck you for killing Jesse! Fuck you for existing! And fuck you because of everything that Laura Bailey went through, because of her amazing performance as you, and everything else in this fucking game! Fuck you, you absolute shit stain, motherfucking cunt! However, I will say th that this boss battle is pretty cool, not gonna lie. But, uh, that still doesn't save this game. Context-sensitive button prompts, yay! Get stabbed, you cunt! How do you feel?! Oh, my switchblade is gone. Yikes! Here we go again! Uh, 
Ah! Ah! How can you still fight? You are considerably less jacked than you were in the beginning of this game. How can you still fight? Ah! Tch! Ah! 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 How can either of them still fight, to be honest? Like, because Ellie has to have a lot of stamina to, to last this long. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that looked like it hurt. Yeah, it probably did. After everything that you did, you still want to beg for mercy? After everything that you did, no! You don't get to beg for mercy, you cunt! You absolute cunt! You do not get to beg for mercy! Oh, ouch! And those are Ellie's fingers gone. Yeah, why was that necessary? Oh, and by the way, Potato? Yes, Moshi? Are you ready for the most cosmic ass pull that this game is getting ready to drop on your ass? What do you mean, cosmic ass pull? Do not tell me that Ellie doesn't go through with- doesn't- Does Ellie actually go through with killing Abby, or- FUCK YOU! FUCK YOU! FUCK YOU! NO! CHOKE THIS BITCH OUT! WHAT ARE YOU DOING?! No! No! You did not just fucking do that! That is so goddamn asinine! After everything that this bitch has done, you're gonna let her walk away! Are you fucking kidding me? That is the most asinine bullshit that I have ever fucking seen! Are you fucking kidding me? No, that is not how this ends. That is not how this fucking ends. It is how this ends, Potato. Abby gets to walk away scot-free from everything that she did. All because Ellie had a, had a last minute change of heart. Wow. That is so incredibly fucking stupid! That is so incredibly fucking stupid! If I were in Ellie's shoes, I would have choked that bitch and let Atlantis and, and let fucking Poseidon deal with her! I would have choked the life out of that bitch after everything that she did! Anyway, I guess this is the epilogue. Back on the farm where the game should have ended. And now Ellie is lacking two fingers. Yep. What are you expecting to find in there, Ellie? I hope it's not a character voiced by Shannon Woodward and her adopted son. What do you mean, Moshe? Remember what I said in the last episode? Just give it a minute. I want this to settle in. Deserved, you idiotic, revenge-obsessed cunt. Your girlfriend's gone. Your adopted son is gone. All of your friends are dead. And it's all because you decided to re pursue revenge. How do you feel? How do you feel that everyone you know and love is fucking gone? 
Everyone that you cared about is fucking gone. And it's all your fucking fault. Oh god, another flashback. And it's the one that... And it's the one that sucks the hardest. Cause remember who died in the beginning of the game? Seth under control. Yeah. And you need to stop harassing Jesse about my patrols. She, that was just one kiss, it didn't mean anything, she just, I don't know why she... But you do like her. <sighs> Stupid. I have no idea what that girl's intentions are, but... But I do know that she would be lucky to have you. You're such an asshole. I'm not trying to. I was supposed to die in that hospital. My life would have fucking mattered. But you took that from me. He saved your fucking life. Go to hell! There's somehow the Lord gave me a second chance at that moment. I would do it all over again. I think I can ever forgive you for that. But I would like to try. Ha! <laughs> Spoiler alert! They never patch this up, considering what literally just happened in the first act of the game. Go to literally every hell that is possible, game. Okay. I'll see you around. Yep.
Is this the end, Moshe? Yeah, I think it very well is. Just uh, wait till Ellie walks off screen or the credits roll. Bye, Ellie. Hopefully we won't see you again because, uh, yeah. And that, ladies, gentlemen, friends, and others, was The Last of Us Part 2. What more can I say? This game drained me. And I mean it fucking drained me. Words cannot describe how asinine that ending is. How, how much, how so much bullshit could have been avoided if they let people explain things. Like, if Joel had explained to Abby why her father died in the first game. He probably would have been spared, and Abby would have gone after Ellie. That would have been a much more compelling story than, Oh, you killed my father, now now I'm gonna make your surrogate daughter flip the fuck out and take revenge against me, killing everybody I love, and ruining her life by extension. Ugh. But at least it's over now, Potato. It's over now. Yeah. You're damn right it is. But do you have anything nice to say about the game? New Game Plus? Ha! <laughs> Fuck that! <sighs> Matter of fact, I do have a few good things to say about this game before we wrap up. One. The voice performances all around were fucking excellent. Notably, Laura Bailey and Ashley Johnson. Laura Bailey did an amazing job as Abby Anderson, even though I fucking despised her character, and still do, despite everything that, that the game has tried to build up. And Ashley Johnson. She does a spectacular job at portraying a young, an older, more gruff Ellie, and I think she pulls it off very well. I've explained what I dislike throughout this video and everything else in the other episodes. That being said, we're done. We are finally done. <sighs> that being said, if you guys enjoyed The Last of Us Part 2, please check the playlist outro to see where it all began. And I will see you guys in whatever I do next. But, before we end things, some fucking catharsis. So apparently you can't break PS4 discs. You can bend them, but you cannot break them. God damn it.